Good morning. We're standing here in Ridgeway on the southeastern outskirts of Haywards Heath. And I'm about to show you number 10, which is one of the new houses just up on the right hand side there. Um, but just to explain to you where we are, we're, uh, Ridgeway is down off the bottom of Green Hill Way. And Green Hill Way is off Hurstwood Lane. Um, Hurstwood Lane used to run as a lane down opposite the Birch Hotel all the way down to Fox Hill. Uh, but you can't drive down or well, drive through that bit now. You've got to go down the Haywards Heath Bypass. So we're right over on the southeastern side of town and we're very close to countryside here. So this development was part of uh, Taylor Wimpy's Green Hill Grange development. Uh, the main part of the development is, was only finished probably about 18 months ago. And the property I'm about to show you is the former show house of phase one and probably the best position. And actually this one's probably got one of the best plots in the development, which was actually built back in 2017. It's hard to believe that that was all done back then. So um, let me show you around. So it's a nice development. Um, like all these developments, they're private estates. So most of these new developments, you, you're part of a private and managed estate. So all the roadways, all these parks, there's a little children's park opposite, um, are all managed. So they have to be maintained and everyone pays a charge, uh, which in this case is uh, £330 a year. So the house you're going to look at is this one here, number 10. So this was the show house. Um, it's got, you'll see, like, like all these developments, if you ever want to buy a new build again, always go and buy the first phase where they had the show centre. So these were all their show houses or their prime houses on prime plots. And this one in question had this fabulous corner plot. So they've got this nice... Uh, laurel hedge which is establishing well and there's actually a bit of space down the side of the house which i'll show you when i come out the window and you're actually opposite the little bus stop now the bus runs from here this is the this is the compass travel bus you have a quick look at that that's the timetable that goes all the way down to the station and round to linfield so even though you're on the outskirts of town on foot it's a 1.9 mile walk down to the railway station um or jump on the bus why not i think it goes every hour so it's good good bit position to be and the development adjoins glorious countryside over the back here and you can go and take your dog for a walk over in Colwell Woods and there's going to be a new primary school built down in Hurstwood Lane so this side of town you're officially in East Sussex can you believe it people say really Haywards Heath is in West Sussex this little part of Haywards Heath is actually in East Sussex so officially you're on Lewis District Council's uh, uh, jurisdiction um, which gives you lots of privileges, uh, one being schooling. So actually you can send your kids from here to Oat Hall Secondary School, which is down in Linfield, or they can go to um, Chaley Secondary School out in South Chaley. Now, as you can see, we've got a lovely long driveway. They have had three cars off the road here. You've got a front garden. If you really wanted to sacrifice it for additional parking, you could. Um, but like a lot of these new builds, they build these garages now, which are actually a bit bigger than normal. So a big single garage, you've got the loft space up there. This has got an electric door, plenty of power and lighting. I'll just flick that light off, close the door. Electric door, which is always nice. And come and have a nose inside. Now being the ex show house, this had lots of upgrades. So one thing being funny enough, the landscaping had a huge amount of planting going on. And the owners um, obviously bought it from Taylor Wimpy as the show home. I mean, they've actually found another brand new uh, Taylor, Wh Taylor Wimpy uh, show home, but uh, that's further away, so they're relocating. So, do come in. Right, entrance hall, lovely hall. Now, something the owners have upgraded as well is they had these beautiful floor tiles. These, these are actually tiles, it's not timber, it looks like timber, um, but all lovely tiling. Little handy hidey hole under the stairs if you wanted that for a doggy basket or something like that. And they continued this tiled floor throughout the ground floor. So sitting room, a double aspect room. So windows front, that's just a feature electric fireplace. And then they've got the doors out to the garden, super garden. I'll give you a glimpse of that while we're here. And they've got walls on one side of it, which is good. They've done a lot of land, extra landscaping out in the garden. And all the, it's hard to believe it, but when you're buying a brand new show house, you, that, these people bought everything. They bought all the lighting, the lovely curtains. Happy to take the lighting and the curtains if someone doesn't want them. You've got the upgraded uh, chrome switches. Lots of extras. Handy understairs cupboard there. And this really is either your dining room or, as you can see, the kids' playroom. And that tiled floor continues through. They've got one of these soft... Um, padded floors in for the children or a nice little room as a snug or as a home office which would be quite nice downstairs loo great big downstairs loo with a window there and then for me the best room in the house is this kitchen look at the size of this huge kitchen 
And again, this was the upgraded top spec. So when you're buying some of these new builds, you can buy a, what they call a, a, a bronze package, a silver package or a gold package. I'm pretty sure this one was the gold package. So it had the better kitchen, better fittings. In this case, you've got the contrasting unit. So you've got some of these cupboards are gray, but some of them are white, which is quite nice. And it's got the natural stone worktops and a full range of appliances in here, which is lovely. And you have a window over the sink, overlooking the garden, keeping an eye on the kids, and another window to the side where you've got your side garden as well. And what is really nice, I mean, this is just great for, in fact, while we're here, let's have a look at the garden. What a great entertaining garden. So they've got, they've extended this terrace, so made this terrace even bigger, because they entertain quite a lot. So a nice big seating area there. You've got a bit of space around the side with a great big shed. So even though you've got a garage where you can put all your junk, you've got a decent sized shed as well. And then they've got another seating area, which has all been reinforced. This is all raised decking and it's been reinforced for the strength. They've got a hot tub on there, which is not included. And as you can see, another big seating area for dinner to catch all the afternoon and evening sun. But when you come around here, you get a better impression of this house of just how big it is. A nice size house. So the development, as mentioned, it's a privately managed complex. You're joining countryside. Um, it's all finished now, so it's all been done. Um, if you're a dog walker like me, this is a great place to live because um, you've got, like I say, the countryside galore. You can go down into Colwell Lane, which is a byway. So it's a little gravelly lane that goes through the countryside and through the woods. And that joins, joins lots of footpaths. So you can go down through the Abbots Lee Estate and walk round to Skeynes Hill and all the way down to Willsfield, if you wish, or just down at the Fox and Hounds pub. So upstairs on the landing, big airy landing, windows overlooking the garden. And then let's take you around in order. So main bedroom, super size suites. Again, lots of upgrades, lots of extra wardrobes, beautifully decorated. Again, all this lighting is included if someone wants it. And double aspect, so windows either side. What a beautiful room and all beautifully dressed. So in lots of wardrobes there, and this one has the ensuite, and again, fully tiled this one, so more tiling than you'd ever need, but a fully tiled bathroom. That is not something builders do these days as standard. And obviously the oversized shower, but very nice. Family bathroom next door, again, upgraded spec in here, with a full bath. I like the fact they put the mirror into the tiled walls there as well. But a really good job again with a window for natural light front bedroom double aspect you know, it's nice it's just not a boring house this one and when you come around here you get an idea of this really nice outlook over the little kiddies green opposite and the nice houses beyond now i mentioned schools if you don't know anything about schools because uh, you can send your children to chaley secondary school chaley secondary school is down in south chaley and the kids go to school bus to it from here and the, the significance of that is Chaley is a tiny country secondary school. There's only about 700 children in it. And a lot of people from Hayward Teeth are trying to get their children into it because it is so small and it is achieving great results. Alternatively, our local secondary school, Oat Hall, down in Linfield, is a pretty special school as well. Uh, and it's the secondary school that's got the farm. So there's a proper working farm on there, which is quite nice. And this is the second bedroom, which you could argue is slightly bigger than the main bedroom area, but doesn't have the ensuite. But again, beautifully furnished, uh, beautifully dressed and double aspect with an extra set of wardrobes in here. And again, better lighting. But there you go. That is number 10 Ridgeway. To sum it up, it's got four bedrooms and two bathrooms up here. It's around 1,524 square feet. It was built by Taylor Wimpy Homes. Uh, the owners, as I've mentioned, have found another brand new show house. So there's a complete onward chain. They're very serious about selling it. And if you're serious about buying it, then they'd love to talk to you. And if you are looking seriously, do follow us, Madsen McTaggart, on our Facebook and YouTube channels, as these videos are all live on there before they're on Right Move. And um, do register on our database. But if you're interested, please give us a call. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you found this helpful.